Today I'm going to show you a CSS trick to stylize the siblings of an element using the not selector. So let me show you uh, the final result. As you can see, when I'm going over one of the images, I'm actually applying style to the siblings, to the other images. Now let me show you how to do uh, that. So first of all, this is the HTML structure. So we have just some simple deep elements and I'm using area roles because in my mind I'm thinking maybe this is uh, a component where a user can select one of the images. So I'm using area roles so that for users using a screen reader, uh, this actually appears as um, radio buttons. Okay, so let's switch to the uh, CSS. So this is the trick. So you can target the hover over the entire uh, group of buttons. So basically when you move your mouse over this area here, and then you want to target a specific element. You want to target the radio button. So the child, which is not currently being hovered over. So when I apply some style here, for example, we can apply a grayscale of 100%. This style is not applied to the, to the element I'm interacting with, but to the others. Let me add the transition here of 0.3 seconds. And this is uh, the effect. So it's really nice. We can push this effect even further. You can create an after element for all the buttons with the content uh, position absolute. So let me add a position relative here and then top zero, left zero, a width of 100%. So same width of the uh, parent and then a height of 100%. We want a background color of um, black with zero opacity and then we can apply so transition always 0.3 seconds now when I'm hovering over the section uh, remember we are targeting the elements we are not interacting with and we want for these elements the after pseudo element to become visible with a transparency of 0 0.5. Now, when I go over this element, as you can see, we have this nice effect. It doesn't require any JavaScript. And you can use this to maybe uh, bring a focus to the element the user is interacting with. Okay, that's all and thanks for watching.